Alright, here's a McDermott Thunder Egg. It's decent size. Let's get this guy cut in half and see what it looks like inside. Alright. Let's cut this guy in half and hope for the best. Okay, let's check out this McDermott Thunder Egg. It's okay. Got the classic gold around the mega center, but not super impressive. Got a little something in the middle, that's unusual. We'll have to check that out. pocket of some kind. Not sure what that is though. Interesting. So here's a McDermott Thunder Egg. Um, not quite sure why this is kind of two-tone. Maybe it laid exposed to the sun for a while or something. But uh, and then there's always this white chalkiness that's on the bottom of them well i'm assuming the bottom of them on one edge of them i guess so i just picked a direction and cut it across the bottom my you know, or top to bottom I, what i thought was and it came out with an interesting star pattern um kind of quartzish that this gold in here is very typical for mcdermott there's something going on there um, but it didn't clean out very well and uh, so this is to me kind of a mediocre egg it'll still take a decent polish but I don't know if it'll be one that goes into my collection so this is McDermott Thunder Egg with a star pattern well, let's get those going on the high speed sander and see what they come out like
product of the uh, McDermott under with the star pattern to it. 